Welcome to Eckert's Cooking Classroom. I'm Angie Eckert and today I'll be making old-fashioned strawberry preserves. This jam recipe has been in the Eckert family for many generations and it is a wonderful way to preserve your freshly picked strawberries. We're starting with a quart and a half of freshly picked Eckert's strawberries. Now we'll rinse them. And we're rinsing them with the caps on to make sure we don't get any extra moisture inside the berries. Now our berries are nice and clean and we're just going to wait for them to dry. We're going to hold the berries and place them in the stock pot. Our berries are hulled and we're ready to add six cups of granulated sugar. We're gonna cover our strawberries in sugar for three hours and let it absorb juices. Our berries are ready for some heat, so we're gonna bring them to a boil. As you can see, our sugar's starting to melt and our mixture's starting to come to a boil. It's time to add the lemon juice. Because this is a traditional recipe for strawberry preserves, it does not call for pectin. Instead, this recipe relies on lemon juice and sugar to set the jam. While we're waiting for our mixture to thicken, add your jars and lids to a pot of boiling water to sanitize them. Our lids and jars are ready to remove from the sanitation water. This is the traditional way, but if you'd like to skip this step, you can purchase freezer-safe containers. This is what our mixture looks like after 20 minutes of thickening. We're ready to spoon our preserves into our sanitized jars. Look at that gorgeous color. We're gonna go ahead and put our lids on our preserves and let them sit on the counter for 24 hours to cool and set up. It's a good idea to set them on a tray with a towel and let them rest overnight before refrigerating. If your family hasn't gobbled it all up within four weeks, you can store the rest in the freezer. This delicious recipe can be found in the Eckert Family Spring Cookbook, along with many more.